Hey everybody, we are Brian and Rachel Goulet of GouletPens.com here to talk about the Fall 2015 Edison Nouveau Premier Seasonal Edition. This is a color we've been wanting to use for a really long time. It just, the timing was never quite right, just never really fit the season, but I think now's the right time. It's a little darker, a little more muted, kind of, uh, you know, a response to those who didn't like the bright or feminine colors of the past. So without further ado, here is... Midnight, Midnight Thunder! Thunder. <laughs> the material is a really dark navy blue. Almost looks kind of black, but when you hit the light right, you can see there's a little bit of pearlescence to it. And it has these white and red striations that go through it. They're going to be different, really pretty different, from mm -hmm. one pen to another. It's very subtle. A little bit of, a little hint of patriotism or something. A little bit, I guess yeah. if you're American. You know. Edison calls this material Commodore. They've been using it in their... It's a naval their, rank, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's a naval rank. But they've been using it for... Uh, <laughs> Yes, that's true, Rachel. <laughs> uh, they've been using it for uh, uh, their... their um, signature line? Signature line. That's what it's there called. There you go. They've been using it for their signature line. This is the first time it's ever been used in any of their production pens. So let's do a quick recap on some of the colors that we've done before, showing it next to the rest of the line. So we started out with Black Ice, and then we did Cherry Blossom. So, yeah, Caribbean Black Ice sea. was winter of 2014. Yeah. Cherry Blossom was spring of 2014. That was a good one. Uh, Caribbean Sea, which I, I love these two. Yeah. Caribbean Sea was summer of 2014. Autumn Harvest was fall of 2014. <laughs> that one's good too. I know. Well, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I picked them. So, I know, they're all you know? good. Um, Majestic Pine, this was winter of 2015. So, mm -hmm. you know, it, it, winter's kind of weird because it kind of overlaps years. But, yeah. you know, it's kind of like cars that come out new before the year. Whatever. Sure. Um, Lilac was the spring of this year. Fireball is the summer which just ended, and now we have Midnight Thunder for fall of 2015. So the way seasonal premieres work is they're available for, well, basically the season. We'll make as many as we're able, as much of the material as we have, mm -hmm. until the next season comes out. As of this video, we do still have Fireballs left from the summer, so we there do. will be a bit of an overlap. But no more are going to be made. So once right. we hit the new season, we stop making the old one, and whatever we have left, it just sells out, and then it's gone forever. So it is the beginning of fall, September 23rd, so it'll be available through sometime in December. We haven't exactly picked the date for the winter to come out. Um, so let's talk a little bit more about the pen. If you're familiar with Edison pens, they're made in Milan, Ohio by Brian and Andrea Gray. Really high quality pens made out of acrylic resin. And these pens in particular use a number six size nib. They're stainless steel nibs that are smooth with a touch of feedback on them. If you're familiar with any of the Edison pens, it's the same nib that's used on most of their uh, signature line as well as most of their production line as well. It takes a uh, cartridge converter, so it's a standard international converter, it's mm -hmm. included. Yep. Um, or you can use short or long, right? Long, long cartridges. cartridges. And it's also eyedropper convertible, so if you want to fill up the whole body with ink, this particular pen is not translucent, so you won't be able to see the ink in it, but it gets you a great ink capacity that way. So we chose silver, we thought it, um, the, the, the polished steel, we thought it matched yeah. the color and the, uh, the nib and the clip match. You can also upgrade to a rhodium nib. So the steel nib comes in extra fine, fine, medium, broad, 1.1 italic and 1.5 italic, or you can get the rhodium plated 18 karat gold nib. Yes. Man, there's a lot of words to say. It's a lot of in words. Extra fine, fine, medium, and broad. The price. It's, ex it's an expensive nib, so you gotta have a lot of words to make it feel right. like you're getting your money's worth. You know what I mean? The price is the same as it always is for the production Edison Nouveau Premier at $149, mm -hmm. um, with the extra charge if you want the gold nib. And this probably goes without saying, but it is an exclusive to GouletPens.com, so you can only get the pens through us. So let's talk about some matching inks, because I know everyone wants to know. I always match my inks with my pens, so, yep. you know, let's talk about some inks. So, Basically, the, the most obvious choice would be to go with a dark blue ink, like yeah. a navy color. This is definitely a navy pen, so going with like a Noodler's Navy, Diamond Majestic Blue. It's going to be a little more well, purple, but well, I Well, the Majestic love Blue would be pretty cool because you it, on the right paper you get the red sheen. There's sheen. a little bit of red in the pen, so exactly. that could bring it out pretty well. Exactly. Diamond Denim. I kind of mm -hmm. equate this pen to like blue jeans. It kind of just goes with everything. You can pick any color, and I think it would go really well with it. I so, think so. Kind of like jeans. So Diamond Denim. There you go. Yeah. Uh, if you want to go with a really dark uh, blue black, you could go with Diamine 1864 blue black. That's from their anniversary edition. Or maybe even Diamine Regency blue would work really well. Lots too. of good blue as well. Lots of good choices. Any blue, lots of good dark blues. You can go red. You can go. You can go pink. pink if you want. Purple. Why not? It's your pen. 
<laughs> do what you want. So you can check out more pictures and more specific technical details on GouletPens.com. It's also where you can purchase the pen if you feel so inclined. If you like this video and you want more like it, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can leave any comments you want on YouTube or on the blog. Thanks so much for watching and right, right on. on.